Van Vleck's great season fell short of the Leopards' ultimate goal when they lost in the first round of the playoffs. However, as our Chevy Spotlight found out, one Leopard player used his football season to fight through a personal loss. Rodney Dowell was hired to be head coach of his alma mater, Van Vleck, in January. After meeting the kids, his first order of business was to switch the offense from the spread to a wing team. After losing their first three games, the Leopards started understanding the offense and they went on a seven game winning streak to win the district title. They never let the tough start weigh on them. A lot of people were doubting us and our defense was finally starting to figure things out a little better. So I, I knew we, we could do better than what we started. I think they realize, you know, once we figure this out and once we get it going the right way, you know, we're going to be pretty good. The Leopards would get bounced in the first round of the playoffs, but it was a season full of learning and growing, especially for junior middle linebacker Sam Brooks. Sam was finally healed from a knee injury that he suffered as a freshman, and he was ready to finally be able to compete at the varsity level. But then tragedy struck. His father, Mark, who taught Sam everything he knew about football, started losing his battle with COVID. Great guy, you know, great dad, and uh, we have evolved everything around football. I mean, he grew up, he went to this high school, played football, and after every game, you know, talking to him. Mark Brooks would pass away before the season started. Everything Sam did to get back to playing shape was for his dad, and now he was gone. Sam's teammates and the Van Vleck community helped raise him back up. They completely lifted me up. They haven't left my side since then. I really, no, I haven't been alone through this whole thing. Sam knew only one way to stay connected with his father, football. After losing out in a tough battle to become the Leopards quarterback, Sam devoted all of his attention to linebacker. Using his dad as motivation, Brooks turned himself into one of the best 3A linebackers in the state. It really changed the way he played. I've never seen him play like he is now. Last year, he's, something's like lit a fire underneath him. He's, he's all over the field. He's, he's leading tackling shot right now. When he didn't get the quarterback spot, you know, there's a lot of kids that might be, you know, hang their head and disappointed. He said no. He just went over there and played the best linebacker, probably best linebacker in the district, you know, or one of them right there at the top, you know, I'm sure. And so, you know, you got to admire a kid that can go, go through all of that. It's just amazing. The season fell short of their goals, but for Sam Brooks, his success on the field has fueled him to work even harder for his senior season, not just for him, but for his dad. I just um, wanted to make him proud, you know, I wanted to do, do it for him. And I know he's with me on the field every game. I know I'm making him proud. I know he's smiling at us right now. The Chevy Spotlight is brought to you by the Houston area Chevy dealers. Visit your nearest Chevy dealer and test drive our award-winning products.